so to create a user chart here uh, in chart code like this we go to planning mode and in planning mode you can see two options root and user chart so you have to click user chart when you click user chart there are two options new and load either you can make a new user chart or you can load the already loaded user chart so here when we click new you can see a name of new user chart has come then you can see there are five options below in the name of symbols point line circle area text in point you can see different legends of anchor arrows void and these all things are available in the point then in line you can see different shades of line then insert you can see here that the circle these symbols basically it shows the circle should be empty or the circle will be in dotted lines or the inside of the circle will be filled same is with the area and then the last option is text so if you want to just add text on the user chart you can click on that now on the right side below attributes you can see there is a third column you can see color so you can choose different color for different uh, user chart uh, objects in chart or like this uh, in user map if you are making a circle for example it will always have two handles those two small circles which are in gray color those we called as handles so in the next diagram you will see the first handle which is marked here in red it is to move the circle from its position to move the circle here and there the second handle is there which is now marked in red it is there to increase or reduce the radius of the circle so for example now in user chart if you are making a text it will have a one handle so all other items like line area those will have one handle so here is one more example of me showing user chart which is editing so here i selected uh, for example a circle so in circle also there are four options like which kind of a circle you want a circle with dark shading inside or circle with light shading or circle with dotted line or a normal circle so for example i selected this circle then i have to click on the chart on the sorry on the actus on the map and then you can see uh, move the circle with my right side this uh, small gray circle by holding that i can increase or decrease the radius of it or i can move the circle with this which is vertically down the small circle which is vertically down and if i want to finish it i just have to right click again on the right side of that uh, circle and it will finish now if i want to move now the circle editing is finished now if i want to move this circle from its position i just have to drag that center button and i have to move it remember our edit option is active that's why we are able to edit this that is a common thing and then we can move it here and there so if i want to add a text to it i just click add to text then write the text which i want to add so here example i'm writing no go area and then i click on the map and you can see it is written no go area if i want to move it i can just i just have to click it and drag it that's it so in chart world like this you have a good option of linking a user chart to a root so basically what happens is so whenever you will open the root the user chart will open with it so for that you have to go to planning mode there you have to go in the root option and then you have to load the root to which you want to link the user chart for example now i have open a root 64b so now to link a chart with it you can see on the right hand side there is a option tab of link user chart so you will right click on that and it will open the user chart which are available in your agdis so now you can select any of the user chart which you want to link with this root so you will select it click on it it will get ticked then you will close the root editing table and you will save the root now once you have saved the root so whenever the root you will load the user chart will open with it so here i am showing how the automatic of user chart happens so what happens is first you open nav then you go and select the root column and then you load the root so whichever root you want to load and then in the bottom you can see automatically load the user chart linked with the root so and that column is ticked 
so whatever route you will load if you have linked any chart it will automatically open with it but if you untick it then no user chart will open with it then you'll then on bottom of it you can see manually select user chart you can also select manually the user chart to load with the present route you want to do this one.